Welcome back guys to another pickups episode. It's been a while since we did one of these. I know that I said I was going to be cranking these videos out, but I really haven't been. I've been slacking. But uh, yeah, we're going to get into these pickups. I want to show you what I got. I got this actually uh, around Christmas time when my niece and nephew came up. And I haven't got to show it yet. But uh, we got this monstrosity right here. I actually won this for a raffle. I don't know how well you can be able to see this. I'll try and... It's a Doctor Strange poster. And uh, I'm actually going to cut to some footage here. And show you guys the... Uh, I won it at a hockey game. So I'm going to cut to the footage here and let you guys see that. Welcome back guys to... Uh, this is going to be a little mini vlog actually. Uh, my niece and nephew came out from North Carolina with their mom. With my stepsister actually. And uh, we're actually at Harbor Yard for the Bridgeport Sound Tigers versus Hartford Wolfpack. And I want to give a big shout out to Sacred Heart. Uh, my aunt works at the Sacred Heart College. And they hooked us up with the Skybox tickets for free. So let's check it out. First we got to get with the, the John Cena. Over here, I'll insert a little. Everyone knows what I'm talking about with the John Cena, but uh, yeah, shout out to Sacred Heart again. My aunt works there, and I appreciate them for free tickets. As you can see, we got the skybox here. VIP. My aunt. Say hi, aunt. I'm Hi. This is my sister. I told you to get bottles. And uh, this is Harvard Yard. They didn't have bottles. So the family has arrived, ladies and gentlemen. The game's about to start. We're going to do a little quick overview. We'll see you guys later. Let's go, Wolfpack! I'm not saying it! What's up, Mark? I'm just going to say, I'm not saying it! I'm not saying it! I'm not saying it! Yep. Oh, that's what I feel like. Yeah, take a picture of him. Like, right. like, 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 you better somebody else better take it. I'm good. Zachary Taylor? Do you have ID? Back in the center for I don't have ID on the note. Do you have, like, an email? I can show you. It's pretty legit. Alright, guys. Just won the raffle at the Sound Tigers game. Got a Doctor Strange poster over here. Can't go wrong with that. Go for a shot. Oh! Oh, my God! Five, four, three, two, one! Oh! 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 So as you can see, I won that at the uh, hockey game there. And now we're going to get into all the pickups that I've accumulated um, after Christmas up until now, which is, I think today is the 15th, if I'm not mistaken. So a couple weeks of pickups. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to start grabbing things over here and we'll show you what I got. So as I've been saying in my couple past couple of videos, I've been really heavy into the card games and I actually just took the plunge and I've got into the Magic uh, the Gathering. We got the Kaladesh bundle here. Um, uh, actually really enjoying the, the Magic the Gathering game. I've been playing it at work with my uh, supervisor, which is kind of strange, but what are you going to do? Um, we'll show a couple of DVDs that I got. I've been trying to get a couple of the Cartoon Network DVDs, and uh, we got Aqua Teen Hunger Force. This is uh, Season 1 or Volume 1, so that's really cool. Not Blu-ray, but I just want to watch it anyways. And this is a nice pickup. This is the Ultimate 100 Greatest UFC Fights. I got this at Goodwill. This is only 3 bucks, and it comes with like 7 CDs or something like that. 26 hours of historic UFC action. So that's really cool there. Um, I picked this up around Christmas as well when my niece and nephews came up. Uh, we went to New York, actually, and we picked this up here. Unfortunately, I had to buy this t-shirt, which I didn't really want to do to get the other item I'm going to show you. But uh, I ended up doing it anyways. It's a uh, Legend of Zelda shirt here, which is really nice. It's got like a little green foil on there. I probably won't wear this, but like I said, I had to buy this in order to get the other item that I'm going to show you. And as I've been saying, Wind Waker is my favorite Zelda game. So we naturally, I had to get... The art sale that they had, they're uh they're doing I think six of these, yeah, six of these art sales. They're collectibles sell, and uh, yeah, you can only get them by going to Nintendo World in New York or New York Nintendo, whatever it's called now. So that's really cool there. And this is only limited edition. They do it. Uh, they're gonna do that's the fourth one, so they have two more that's coming out, which is really cool. So get over there, and then I actually got this for oh Drake and stuff. I bought this before Christmas at like a Marshalls or something. It's a, a Banshee from Halo, which is cool. It was like 5 or $7 or something like that. 
that was cool. And this was a pretty funny story. I went to uh, Walgreens actually, and uh, they had like a bunch of clearance stuff for Christmas. And I saw this it was in the uh, the Christmas clearance section, but I didn't know if it was on clearance or not. So it is a Rogue One little mug gift set here. And uh, I didn't know how much it was, so I went up to the counter and asked the guy, and he was like, oh, how much do you want to pay for it? And I said $4, and it rang up for four fifty. So I was like, all right, I'll pay the extra 50 cents. So that was a pretty cool pickup there. Um, let's see. Going with the Halo Mega Blocks theme. Found this at Goodwill the other day for uh, 5 bucks, which is awesome. It is the Gun Goose UNSC. So, uh, and speaking of Mega Bloks, they actually had a, uh, a Halo Mega Bloks game that was in development. If anyone has yet to check that out, I'll link that below so you guys can see that. And uh, I bought this awesome bag of goodies here. Um, I'll show you the real highlight, the reason I bought it. It was only a dollar. But uh, how could you not buy it when there's a ping pong playing Squidward? <laughs> no, nah, but the reason I bought this for a dollar, well, one, they have this little Skylanders guy, which is cool. But they actually had uh, the Yoshi Amiibo in there, which is really strange and cool. So I actually have this uh, brand new, but I wanted one loose so I could play with the, the Yoshi game, Yoshi Yarn Yoshi game. And they have a 3DS one coming. And you can probably hear my cat in the background squeaking. Um, let's hop into these cool pickups here. I went to a Walmart and uh, asked for this little display piece here. It's the PSVR Worlds and Rigs little standee here. So I'll put that somewhere in the game room. This was a really cool pickup. Um, I haven't really got too much into this website with the, the limited run games or whatever. But they had two games that came out that I really, really wanted. And I decided to uh, pick them up. So we got Oddworld Stranger's Wrath. Um, this is a PS Vita game. I actually have it downloaded on my Vita. And it was probably one of my favorite Vita games and one of my favorite Xbox games. This was on the original Xbox. This is a remake of it. So, uh, yeah, if you guys haven't checked this out, please uh, definitely do. It's a really fun game. Um, I don't think, well, it's limited run. So, yeah, this is not up for sale anymore. So, if you want to go on eBay and pick it up, definitely do or download it. And then this one, um, this is a little indie game that came out. And I haven't, like I said, I haven't played this yet. But if this is Firewatch. I, actually, I heard this was an excellent game. So, I decided to pick it up. I heard it's kind of short, but uh, very good. So, we'll test that out eventually. And those all came with, like, limited run little pamphlet that tells you all their games that have came out a little greeting card here a map and your couple of stickers so that's really cool and limited run actually have a couple more games coming out that i want to pick up they have ocean horn which uh, i heard is kind of like zelda the wind waker so that's right up my alley and they have salt and sanctuary which is kind of like a dark souls uh, bloodborne type of game that is 2d so definitely be on the lookout for that um this my brother actually gave me he uh he knows i like zelda a lot and he picked up the Link Orcarina of Time Amiibo, 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 Amiibo. <laughs> so that's really cool. I haven't really picked any of these up in a while. Um, I was excited for the Breath of the Wild ones, but for some reason they're on on the Best Buy website and every website that they're on, they're like $15.99 or something. So I don't really know if I'm going to be paying that much for them because these are usually like $13 with the, with the Best Buy Gamer Club Unlocked. It's like $10. So uh, yeah. And this was another really cool pickup here. I actually pre-ordered this probably seven, eight maybe nine months ago um and it finally came out the uncharted 4 uh vinyl soundtrack here you could get this from i am 8-bit i'm not sure if they're selling this particular version this is the avery coin version when you uh take it out which i'm not going to because it's hard to put back in there but when you take it out the uh disc itself is actually avery's coin which is awesome and uncharted 4 was probably one of my favorite games from last year um, a couple little loose end things here. There's like these little Zelda grab bag things, like the mystery boxes or whatever. Um, I picked up a couple because they were a dollar at Walmart. And we ended up getting uh, Link from the Wind Waker, Zelda from the Wind Waker, and Ganondorf from the Wind Waker. And that's my favorite series, so that was awesome. And then we got another one of the little grab bag things. We got another Zelda from uh, Wind Waker. A couple more Blu-rays here. Due date. And Unknown. Unknown is actually a really good movie. Um, it has Liam Neeson in it. And it is about a guy who, he gets into like a car accident and he wakes up. And basically his wife um, says he, she doesn't know who he is. And someone else has claimed his identity. So it's a pretty cool movie there. And Due Date is absolutely hilarious. Check that one out as well. So, alright, let's get into one of the mini bags I have over here. 
I picked these up actually two days ago. I'm on a 360 kick right now. I'm collecting a couple of 360 games. And uh, so yeah, we picked up Bullet Witch. I actually was interested in this in this one that came out back in the day. I just never ended up dropping the 50 or $60 it was at the time. So yeah, picked that up. Hey, keep it down. <laughs> Trying to record a video over here. Um, but yeah, Bullet Witch. I actually just hooked up my 360 because I'm sick of all the download times for Xbox One and stuff. So I just, I wanted to play Mass Effect and it was taking like three or four hours. So I was just like, yeah, I'll put it on my 360 and play instantly. Then we picked up Two Worlds. Um, this is an RPG that I heard semi-decent things about. But uh, it was only 89 cents, which is awesome. But when I, when I brought it up to the calendar, the lady said it was $3. I was like, I'm not paying $3. So I was going to put it back. And she's like, no, I'll give it to you for the 89 cents. So I was like, okay. Let's check out this bag. Oh, yeah. And as you saw, I got the Doctor Strange poster. Doctor Strange poster. And then not even like three or four days later, I went to a Goodwill. And they had the Doctor Strange pop. So uh, I got to go check this movie out. I haven't seen it yet. I paid three bucks for this. I heard the movie was really good. I uh, can't wait for it to come out on Blu-ray because I will be buying it and watching it. But it was just kind of strange, no pun intended, that I got the poster and I got the uh, pop here. So that was cool. What is this? Uh, this was another Goodwill find. This was only a dollar. I think it might have been 50 cents. I can't remember exactly, but it's a little Star Wars mug here, which is cool. I actually kind of got a lot of Star Wars mugs in this video that you just saw the other set that I got. And then I got this one. It's from 2012, but it's really, really nice. Put that over there. And since we're on the mug uh, kick there, we got another mug. <laughs> Star Wars. This was at Target. Um, I brought it up to the counter because there was no price sticker. And it was uh, in the Christmas section again, which Christmas stuff was like 90% off. And they basically told me I could have it, so I took it. All right. Because I bought a couple extra things. This is one of the things that I got. A little Darth Vader ornament. Which again, this was 90% off. I think this was like a dollar or something like that. Which is cool. Put that over there. We'll use that next Christmas. What is this? Oh, the one, the lone little guy. Another one of those little uh, ornaments here. This is Kylo Ren. So we'll put that on the tree next year. Put that over there. Grab this stuff. More Target stuff. These are, like I said, this was all 90% off. We got a uh, stocking here of Ray which is cool. That'll be for the girlfriend. Then we got this really cool one here that I kind of want for myself, but I'm not sure because uh, whatever, BB-8 there. But I'm not sure if I want that one because I actually want this one here, Kylo Ren. I think we actually got these from Goodwill. Yeah, this one I got from Goodwill. Those two I got from Target, and then these two were at Goodwill that I got here. We got another BB-8 one, which I don't know why we need four stockings when there's only two people, but hey, we can. options is always good, right? I think those were a dollar at Goodwill, so let's see what this, oh, and then I got this one for uh, my dad, he likes Captain America, so I'll give that to him, and this one was at, that was at Target as well, let's hop right into this, I actually thought this video was going to be a little bit longer, but this was a Goodwill find, we picked up the Ghostbusters Lego Dimensions Fun Pack, this was only a dollar. It was open. I checked to make sure everything was in here, and it was. Everything's kind of broken up in here now, but everything was in there, and I put the, the two characters together, so that's pretty cool there for a dollar. And then while I was at that same Goodwill, I actually found this. This was $4. It's a little Wii U uh, charging stand here with the little battery packs on the, yeah, rechargeable battery packs. So 4 bucks, it can recharge your Wii U and Wii controllers. And uh, speaking of Wii U... It's uh, the Wii U is basically done for now. Um, they just showed the Switch, which I actually got pre ordered, which is awesome. But um, after this video, hopefully, I will be trying to get a Wii U collection video up before the Switch lands. And uh, yeah, so stay tuned to that. Uh, last video, I think I picked up a Studio Ghibli or Ghibli, whichever way you say it, VHS, and we got another one uh, here, Spirited Away. I've not seen this one either. And I don't have the DVD or Blu-ray, so I will be hooking up my VHS and uh, checking this out. Those are the first VHSs I've bought probably in 20 years. <laughs> Check out what we got here. This I found yesterday, actually, last night. Um, I guess we'll show this. <laughs> we got some Star Wars gum. That was a dollar. I don't even know why. I just... Star Wars. So I picked it up. And then we picked up a Wii U Pro Controller. 
Um, the box you can see is kind of jacked up because someone opened it or whatever. But I did open it and uh, everything looked brand new in there. It was still in the baggie and the cord is still wrapped up. And as you can see, I paid $20 there. So I want to get a couple of, as many accessories as I can before the Wii U goes out because uh, it's going to be kind of hard to find those things. Not really too many people bought it. Put that out of the way. And then the last thing I found, this was a couple days ago at Goodwill. We found a Monopoly board. This is all brand new inside. We got the World of Warcraft Collector's Edition, and I did pay $10 for this because this is absolutely awesome. Um, I'm not a big WoW fan, but my brother is, and whenever he comes over, uh, I'm, <clears throat> we can play this together and uh, have some family time, you know what I mean? So that was really cool, and like I said, everything inside there was brand new, never opened. So I think that that is it. So thank you guys again for watching. Oh, also I want to say thank you to everyone I actually hit. 50 subscribers which is absolutely fantastic um i that honestly is mind-blowing when i started this i didn't think i was going to get that many subscribers but uh 50 is awesome here's to 100 when i hit 100 subscribers i will do a uh, giveaway so like i said thank you guys uh family friends and strangers who uh subscribed and watched my content uh i hope you guys really like it and yeah so there will be a video going up tomorrow actually it's going to be my z log um it's going to be with the GoPro, so you guys will see that. Um, but yeah, so thank you guys for watching. We will see you on another video. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. Uh, thanks, like I said, thank you guys for watching. Take care.